Good day everybody, this is Men, and I want to show you how to make custom uh, made forests, like a dead forest, uh, like I did on my one of my latest maps. So, for this one, um, my latest uh, version is a bit more uh, customized and stylized, but the process is the same, um, where I just Im uh, imported way more uh, assets and uh, trying to figure out a good balance between trees, assets uh, and surroundings. And so this is just a test world currently where, where I am on. Where I'm try, uh, trying to test out different biomes and uh, all my assets. And yeah, so we are trying to um, generate then basically something like this in here uh, in a bigger scale. Let's start all the way from the start. Go to a new world. The starting uh, settings doesn't really matter. And when you're starting out, it should look like something like this. The the interface is, of course, a bit different. <laughs> it's uh, a dark, sc uh, dark scheme, but there are tutorials how to do this uh, or how to change this, but the general structure is the same. Starting with uh, the terrain, we need a custom floor, we need custom assets, and we needed a combination layer. So for the terrain, we go onto custom terrain, custom material, complex, blobs, and then we add um, here are different types, so I want to use Cursed or Coarse Dirt, however you pronounce it. Then I want some Rebel. There we go. Then we have our blobs. So the, technically this is all you need, but um, you can of course add and change everything how you wish. And we can uh, change the scaling or uh, the amount of everything uh, for every single part. So, Keeping the, the gravel a bit more down, the dirt more high up. We have now our um, rough terrain. So if you, you can also hand paint it directly already in. So this is just as a test. But now we want to um, have custom um, assets. And then therefore we need custom ob a custom object layer. Where we basically have here the button to import everything. So we need uh, a few rocks. So I have one, a few imported. Let's use those. And then, increase the size, 500 rocks. So this part is important because you need to space them a bit more out. Um, a good size is between 500 and uh, 1000, depending on the map size. Uh, but therefore I would advise, uh, make a test map like I did, uh, like I did here. Uh, where I just have a flat world and uh, placing everything in and checking out how it works. Um, from here on, I can hand place then around, let's say, 800. That can work. I select the color to, to white or to a grayish. Um, this is the preview pattern only, so you can see kind of how it could look like. And then the rocks get imported. Then we need a second one. Uh, custom. Uh, trees well, for the custom trees i mean since we are going for the uh, dead forest we need a few a few dead um assets basically i have here uh, quite a bunch so we have a few stumps and a few dead trees we select them import them and with the trees it's important that we of course uh place them all one by one one down select okay do the, do the rest and also for all of the other maps, uh, all, the, all, the, all the other trees. Oh, and, and of course, uh, tree, space them a bit more out by 75. With dead trees, you can even go further with 100. Around about 100, 150. This should work to give them a bit more space to, uh, to breathe. <laughs> Uh, select the color. This is up to you. So now, um, the last part that I that you need to know is you can either uh, hand place uh, everything here and into the map. Um, oops. So here, of all the colors, so if we solo them, you can see everything in part. And then we need just one more thing, and this is the custom combined layer or the combined layer where we do everything. So here we have the option to use this uh, different terrain. 
And if we scroll all the way down, we find at, down below at the bottom, the custom materials, which is the gravel that we set up. Then we have, of course, the biome. We can set it to tiger, whatever we wish. And then we can add the custom layers. This would be the tree. And this would be uh, the rocks. So we can set the preview again. Mm, set the trees to around about. Yeah, the trees are fine, I think. Rocks are also kind of fine. Yeah, that works. Uh, that forest. There's one more thing that we would have to add. So there is uh, the custom plants layer down here. So we clicked it. And then we can uh, add grass and add shrub. But um, keep in mind that shrub doesn't spawn on um, placed grass or gravel. Um, therefore, there is a solution to this, I, I found. Um, so you can technically uh, let this off. Uh, just place it as plants and make a separated object layer. Um, I have I have tested this. This actually worked for some reason. <laughs> I used the shrug. Uh, I copied just a shrug. Uh, shrug. 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 I don't know. Um, for some reason it doesn't. Where is it? Never mind. Uh, it's too small. Oh, cool. My computer is getting full. So, there you can see it's not really visible. Uh, we double click on it. Say on air. So it doesn't show again. Uh, but I can tell you it will work. Probably it doesn't really show up. So give it a good name, shrub. Uh, we can also place this also by hand in again. Um, or go into the... Um, let's call this biome. And add it here with the shrub. And also the plants. Yep, this is how you can do it. Uh, we can maybe turn turn the plants a bit more down to give it a better feeling. But otherwise, uh, we are pretty good off to go. Mm, but the, sh the custom assets uh, like the plants and traps won't, uh, won't really display, unfortunately, for some reason. I don't know. So there we have it. Uh, we have now the biome and we can place it then uh, or paint it then in. And this is exactly what I did then. Oops. This is exactly what I did uh, with my biome here. Of course, um, with my latest map that I did and showed in the preview, I made it uh, a bit more manually, where I just hand placed everything, um, everything layer by hand. But the outcome is the same. So yeah, this is how you can do a dead forest. My name is Men. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, stay tuned uh, if you want to wish more um, custom biomes or uh, if you want to see how other things are made. Take care. Bye bye.